Frank Vincent, who played the mob boss Phil Leotardo on The Sopranos, died on Wednesday. He was 78. The actor died of complications from heart surgery in New Jersey, according to reports from The Blast and TMZ. Vincent also portrayed a trio of memorable tough guys for director Martin Scorsese in 1980's Raging Bull, 1990's Goodfellas, and 1995's Casino, one of my favorites. On HBO's hit show The Sopranos, Leotardo often butted heads with James Gandolfini's Tony Soprano, as he eventually rose to become boss of his crime family. Vincent said in a 2011 interview, he didn't fool around. Phil was serious. He had a job to do, and he thought, you know, the Soprano guys from Jersey. What does that mean? We're New Yorkers. The Jersey mob is nothing. They don't even prick their fingers when they do the ceremony. Some of the writing for Phil was just brilliant. Yeah, that was my Phil impression. He did it better. The actor's film resume also included the Pope of Greenwich Village, Brian De Palma's Wise Guys, Spike Lee's Do the Right Thing and Jungle Fever, Sidley Lumet's Night Falls on Manhattan, James Mangold's Copland, Shark Tale, and Chicago Overcoat. Vincent also appeared in Hype Williams' Belly in 1998. And get this, he served as the official acting coach to rappers DMX, Nas, and Method Man in the film. In 2006, Vincent co-wrote the book, A Guy's Guide to Being a Man's Man. For more on the life and career of the great Frank Vincent, head to THR.com. And in the meantime, let us know your favorite memory of the actor in the comments below. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Jeremy Hassel. This episode of The Hollywood Reporter News is brought to you by American Airlines, Hollywood's favorite airline.